Hey there, this is a personalized message specially for you. I have a question. Why don't you start preparing early for CSI net or GATE or any competitive exam? Well, you will say there is stress, master syllabus, huge. But I have 10 points today to help you understand why you should start preparing early. So let's get started. Here we are. Why start preparing early? Because you need success and you have to get it even before anybody else gets it. So here's the thing which I want to highlight. No matter how busy you, you are with your masters, remember one thing, your masters will just give you one degree, which will be good for nothing. Yes, sorry to say that, that's the truth. All the internals, all the externals, all the lab work, all the laboratory manuals, it will be of no use because you will be just another person in the crowd. If you want to stand out of the crowd, you have to write these exams and to, you know, qualify these exams, you have to start preparing early. Now, why do I say that? Let me show you. So I have 10 reasons today for you. The first one is it will save you time because once you start preparing after your masters, imagine you would have, you know, uh, prepare, you know, finish your masters and then you start preparing and this syllabus is you know, like seven or eight times bigger than masters. So it will take you another one year to qualify or study the entire syllabus or, you know, the important topics. That's where it will become painful. Okay. But if you start preparing early, just take out three hours per day. That's it. Three hours in the evening, attending classes at Biotechnica and you will be able to qualify. So that is where it will save you time. The next one, more time to practice. See, when you start early, you win early. That's a mantra. And see, you are experiencing right now one master syllabus. It's hectic, right? But when you will try for qualifying CSI and it, it is maybe three or five times the syllabus. I don't want to scare you, but I'm telling you that if you study every day, three, three hours, you would have finished the master's anyways. Plus you would have finished the CSI and syllabus also. You'll be ready to qualify. Now, as per the internal survey done by Biotechnica, we found out that people who prepare while they're studying have higher chances of qualifying because the concepts are fresh in their mind. Yeah. So the next point is syllabus is huge. Like I said, syllabus is huge. So why not divide it into small, small parts and study for the next one year or two year and, you know, finish it off. That way you will become a master of the syllabus and only a master of the syllabus can qualify any exam. Isn't that right? Well, another point, point is gain momentum. Now you see a fast bowler, he starts running from far and then he will bowl. Why, do, why does he do that? Because that way he gains the momentum. The same way when you start preparing early, you will you would have gained the momentum. And because these classes will be on the weekdays, Monday to Friday, uh, you know, uh, 7 o'clock to 10, 10 o'clock, it's a working professional and student special batch. What will happen is just three hours per day, no assignments after that, just study whatever they're teaching. It will go into your mind, practice questions, easy to go. Best part, you will get weekends to, you know, finish, you know, look at your masters or your uh, CSR. But here is the thing, taking stress, you know, three hours per day is easier than taking all the stress after your masters. So I think you should go for it. The next is gaining experience. Now, you see this, when you are preparing for CSIR net, you will be exposed to multiple multitudes of uh, subjects like ecology, evolution, methods in biology, biochemistry, molecular biology, genetics multitude you'll gain a lot of experience and that experience and expertise will help you grow in your career like kiran majumdar shah said once that you know biotech industry is a knowledge intensive industry and knowledge is potential power so you have to apply that knowledge and that is what csir net is all about applying knowledge so i don't want to scare you here but i want to tell you that it is better to prepare early so that you can stay ahead of the competition you see other people will start preparing after two years, but you, you would have prepared now, you will be ahead of the competition. That's how you win the competition. How do you win a race? Because you're ahead. You get an early start, you win early. CSIR net is a marathon. Okay. It's not a hundred meter race. It's a marathon. Go slow, go slow. And the last lap, you have to increase your speed. Okay. Next one, it helps in your masters as well. Many students will come and say, sir, I am taking so much stress studying the, uh, you know, syllabus of CSIR net. Will it help me in masters? 
yes it will help you why because the masters uh, syllabus is almost the same it's not no different okay it's more or less the same similar thing similarity is there 30 to 50 percent syllabus will be same so it will help you there as well the concept studied here will help you there the concept studied there will help you here but while it is fresh in the mind that's when you have to strike the target okay the next one is avoid frustration after masters you know many students after they have finished masters then they'll be like Ab kya? what should we do and then they will look around and then say okay everybody is preparing for CSI net let me prepare why not do that early because after masters instead of being directionless you will know your direction and that's what next point is little stress per day suppose you have to climb Burj Khalifa in Dubai so and the lift is not working just focus on the stairs one step at a time that's how you climb that's how you get there Right? Isn't that right? So this is where little stress per day is better than taking too much stress after your masters and feeling directionless and frustrated. And then obviously the, the time parents will be pressurizing for marriage or job, all that. Instead, you prepare now, you already would have a job and that's a PhD with a fellowship. Isn't that great? Next and last one, definite destination after masters. You already know your direction, you already know where you're going and you would have achieved it by the time you have finished your final years. Now, you'll also, while you're preparing in your master's itself, you'll write CSI and suppose two times, three times, you'll gain experience. So you will know what it is sitting in that exam, marking the, you know, MCQs, you'll have, you would have gained the experience three times, definitely you'll, you know, win in the fourth time. And that's what I wanted to tell you guys probability is the key the more you write more are your chances of qualifying and that is how biotechnica's coaching is built we don't want you to qualify in one attempt we want you to qualify if you start early you reach better okay you start early you qualify better so that's all about today's video guys here's a point i want to make very very clearly start early win early <clears throat> you have to have a clear unidirectional focus towards your goal that's it Okay, clear focus, burning desire to achieve success. Once you are a PhD, you can get a job in US, you can get a job in Europe, India, Germany, wherever you want, Japan, China, the whole world is open for you. But once you're just a part of a master's degree, you just get a master's. But just taking two to three hours extra, you win the world. I believe that you can win the world. What do you say? So go ahead, enroll with Biotechnica, CSI and coaching. The link is given in the description. Please don't delay because... I know you will win. If you want to contact me, you can contact me on zipmessage.com slash biotechnica or you can just drop a comment below. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye-bye.